Hi, I'm David Beers, founding editor of the Taiyi. Uh, the Taiyi is a wild idea, and that's why we named it after a wild salmon. And it was created to broaden the conversation in Canada, to bring more ideas, news, and solutions to the broader conversation. Ten years later, I think we've done that. My name is Jeff Dembicki. I'm the lead climate change and energy reporter for the Taiyi. I was the first Canadian journalist to write about the Keystone XL pipeline. My name is Katie Heslop, and I'm the only education reporter that I know of whose job has required firearms training, getting a fish, and taking a field trip to an ancient burial ground. Hi, I'm JB McKinnon, and I'm just standing in this community garden thinking about how much has changed since the 100 mile diet first appeared on the Taiyi. The Taiyi was, has been, is, uh, essential to the local food movement in Vancouver and British Columbia and beyond. My name is Gus Van Harten. I'm an associate professor at uh, Osgoode Hall Law School. About a year ago, I decided to speak out publicly against uh, an investment treaty between Canada and China. Van Harten had incredibly powerful arguments against this treaty, arguments that had not been surfacing in the wider media. I was quite impressed with uh, the Taiyi uh, and its quality of coverage. So it's my second morning in Washington, D.C., and I'm out for coffee with a former Republican congressperson turned oil lobbyist. It became clear to me that for this oil lobbyist, Canada's oil meant American freedom, and he was already working with the highest levels of the Canadian government to ensure that every last drop of that freedom made it across the U.S. border in the Keystone XL pipeline. That's when I realized the Taiyi was on to a pretty big story. You know, the Thai's success to date is completely due to our readers. Whether it's our readers sharing our stories with others, telling people about the Thai, commenting on the Thai, or even sending us dollars, um, the Thai really owes its success to you. So thanks for a great 10 years, and here's to 10 more.